Welcome to On The Beat everyone, I'm Troy Thompson. Joining me in the studio today is Jeff and Tyler Farnham with JTS and Company Mortgage Professionals. Today we're talking about the next generation and family business. Welcome to the show, both of you. Yeah, good morning. Tyler, nice to meet you. Your dad brags about you continually. Well, I appreciate <laughs> he thinks it. you're pretty well all right. He's all right. Yeah. <laughs> um, of course, uh, I've been saying to your father that you should be coming into the show because it's a, it's a family business. Tell everyone at home where JTS came from. In 1996 when we started the company, my yeah. wife and I were sitting around the table just trying to figure out what would we call the business. And, um, you know, obviously my wife's very important to me. My son was the only child I had at the time, very important to me. And I said, you know, it just kind of came to us, JTS. So it stands for Jeff, Tyler, and Stacy. It has just right. tremendous sentimental value, you know, to us. No, no franchise value other than we've branded it over the years. And then the, the end company is we, we knew we'd have additional children one day. And uh, so we have a daughter, Tori. So she kind of piggybacks on the T as well. Eh? All right. So did you know at five that you were going to be getting into the mortgage business? or I did not. I had no it was, clue. At, it was this is what five. you're doing. Yeah. It's like I think Tiger Woods when he was becoming, you know, uh, his father wanted him to become a professional golfer, right? Um, isn't that your father's passion? I, it is. It so is. which one's going to make you more money? Do you think? Uh, mortgages, <laughs> probably. Yeah. I'm not very good at you're golf. Very so. good at golf. <laughs> okay, so your father and I have talked for the last year, and we've talked about what he enjoys about helping the local community. Mm -hmm. In, in regards to people who don't know where they're going when it comes to their mortgage, they maybe want to refinance. What is the best thing that you like about the business? Helping those that uh, aren't real sure if they can live the quote unquote American dream of owning their own home. Um, having those people come in and saying, hey, I don't know if I can buy a house. I want to buy a house. I get pleasure and uh, happiness out of helping those people fulfill those dreams they have. When you buy your first property, it's probably the biggest step. Absolutely. Apart, probably apart from marriage and having your first child, I, yeah. I think. Yes. But it's your first seriously big debt that's going to be hanging around you. Your Absolutely. father said to me that he likes to walk the clients through on how this is going to look over the next few years and also how to prepare mm -hmm. for the mortgage. Right. Um, what do you tell your clients? I've, I've watched him over the years and, and I've kind of modeled my... I guess you could say speech and my meetings over the way he does it. Uh, really just trying to be that advisor for them to mm. how, how do you look at this five years from now, ten years from now, what do you need to be prepared for, you know, if life throws you a curveball, how do you handle this, you know, and, and I end every conversation with if you have any questions, you give us a call, we're still here to help you. I think that's important. Mm -hmm. What's it like working with your son? You know, it, it, a dream come true, right? Really? Yeah. So, you know, one of the things I never did, I didn't push him towards the business. Right. You know, well, I uh, think you did. You named it after Well, <laughs> <laughs> but over the years, you know, it was, we'd have conversations, and, he, and early on, he really didn't have any interest in it, you know, and um, it just wasn't finance, wasn't his thing. He didn't see himself sitting in an office and doing yeah. this thing. He's very much an outdoorsman and enjoys those kind of things and uh, loves loved sports and all those, so he just never really thought, but through a series of conversations he had, some prayer time and those things, he, he decided to take a look at it, and I'm so thankful he did, because it's, it's great having him on board, and um, you know, it's something that um, I dreamt about, obviously back uh, when we were name of the company, I always thought we'd be handing that off one day. Uh, I don't know that I'll ever retire, but uh, he may want me to. But uh, I think I, he's sitting I'm on that I couch to push you out. Yeah, he, he's he going to be, be here more yeah. often, I think. Yeah, he may be. Yeah. <laughs> um, you very quickly, you did go to college for baseball, or how yes. did that work? I went on a baseball scholarship to uh, community college. Yeah, uh, played there for a little bit, and then uh, went to Mississippi State after that. Went into landscape architecture. Uh, realized very fast that that was not for me. Couldn't do anything locally around here. Uh, there wasn't a big demand for that, so I went back to business administration and uh, found, finished up my degree on my sixth year and, uh, and then came to work for, for the family company. And that's the way it's going to be. That's all right. Yeah. You need to, we need to have you landscape out the front of the office. Uh, yeah. Do some, <laughs> we do some toperies and things like that. <laughs> yeah. We appreciate both of you. Yeah. Thank you. We're, getting, we're really looking forward to getting to know you as Thank well, you, Tyler. We want to find to out it. more about yeah. Jeff and Tyler. There it all is up on the screen. Let their family help your family with any mortgage concerns you have. Back after this.